What is going on you guys? Good morning and happy Friday. Just got to the gym, of course the music stops as soon as I start talking, so I sound really loud. Um, but I just got to the gym for a full body workout. You guys, I've been slacking on YouTube and it's not because I don't wanna vlog, but it's been so cold, like minus 30 in Calgary. So I've literally just been at home and I'm like, okay, full days of eating, show my workouts, I don't know. I know that that's what I do anyways, but I feel like I've just been such a hermit lately between working and the cold and muffin. But we're here today and we're doing a full body workout. We're gonna be doing exercises that hit the lower body and the upper body at the same damn time. So hope that you guys enjoy it. If you do, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Let's get right into the workout. What's going on guys and welcome to today's workout commentary. Full body workout, so grab yourself a set of dumbbells and we're only gonna use free weights for this exercise. There is no machines. Starting off with some squat presses. So you wanna hold the dumbbells with a neutral grip, just holding them naturally in front of your delts and you're gonna be squatting up and pressing at the same time. So this is a circuit, then we're gonna jump right into some dumbbell reverse lunges with bicep curls. They're gonna be alternating, so you're gonna do 24, which is 12 on each leg. Then we're gonna get into a static lunge with a bicep curl shoulder press, basically. So you're getting into the lunging position, stay there, make sure that you engage your core, squeeze your glutes, and then you're going to basically do the bicep curl and then push up into the shoulder press. So you're gonna be doing 12 on each side there as well. So getting into the next exercise here, we're gonna be doing a superset, which is two exercises done one after the other with little to no rest. So I did switch it up and use the plates. You guys can stick with the dumbbells. There's no need to change or you can switch it up for personal preference. But we're gonna be doing some squats, sumo squats with upright row. Make sure that you're squeezing your glutes at the top. Again, keeping your core engaged. And we're supersetting that with 24 curtsy lunges. And for the last exercise, you guys are gonna grab a barbell and we're gonna do some wide grip row with Romanian deadlift. So wide grip row, Romanian deadlift equals one rep. You're going to be doing 10 of those. So that is going to be it for this full body workout. I hope that you guys enjoyed it and enjoy the rest of the video. Here's a little sneak peek of some merch that I've been working on. You guys can expect more details to come, but I wanted to share with you my breakfast, which every single morning I have the exact same thing, egg whites and sriracha, and then some oats with some stevia drops and frozen blueberries. Just got home from the gym. And Auntie Vika has something for Muppet. Okay, how stinking cute is this, you guys? <laughs> it has, okay, wait, focus. It has little cupcakes on it that are gonna be muffins for Muffin. Oh! She's so so we, we just got back from the gym, picked up Starbucks, and I'm drinking a Americano Misto with almond milk. And I'm gonna be making some post-workout oatmeal. And yeah, that is going to be the next thing that I eat. So it's basically a snow day, you guys. Like I said, it is. Let's see what the weather is right this second. Minus 19, but it feels like minus 28. So the rest of the day, we are gonna be inside eating food. 20 minutes later. All right, so I added a scoop of, I have showed you guys already before, I added a scoop of my One Up Nutrition chocolate vegan protein into my Starbucks and made a mocha and I drank that during my client call. Um, I had a 30 minute catch up call with my girl Sammy that is in London actually. So our time difference is completely different and I always love catching up with her. Um, and now I'm gonna be having my carbs for post-workout and getting a little bit more work done. So let me show you guys this glorious sight. We have 40 grams of oats and then the vanilla stevia drops with cinnamon and 70 grams of frozen blueberries. There's only two types of people in the world. The type that love oats and think it looks like food porn and the type that hates the consistency and thinks that we're gross. Two hours later. So my next meal is some sweet potato, some salmon, and some air fried green beans. 
feel like I've been eating this for months and I still don't get sick of it. I love it so much. Then we have some sriracha and then some sweet brown honey mustard there. For my next meal, I'm gonna be doing a voiceover because I realized my finger was on the mic. I went to go get some pokey, and whenever I get pokey, I get unmarinated tuna and no dressing, kale base. So I had the kale, we had some jicama and cucumber, some beets in there, seaweed salad, pickled red onion, ahi tuna, and an egg with fresh herbs. My next meal is some tilapia with some teriyaki sauce on it and then air fried zucchini, green beans, and some overcooked sweet potatoes because I love my stuff burnt, to be honest. So the stuff that was air fried could definitely have been a little bit more crispy, but I'm hungry. Finishing the night off with my OG meal, sweet egg whites. So it's just egg whites with some pink salt and cinnamon. And I'm so happy because my friend went to Arizona and grabbed this for me. It's only in the States. It's trivia nectar and it's so good. It tastes exactly like honey, but for like a fraction of the calories. And I literally just drizzle it on top so I don't even have a serving. And then almond butter is the best. I literally could eat this. If I, wasn't on a, if I was on an island and I could only have one thing to eat, it'd be almond butter. <laughs> so yeah, I eat this every single night and you can put stevia on it as well, but it's perfect just as is. All right guys, so that is going to wrap up today's video. Hope that you guys enjoyed watching. Thank you so, so much for your support as always. I'm so grateful for you guys. Please do not forget to show your support for the channel by giving it a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe so that you come back and I will see you in the next one. Bye.